On February the 17th, 1944, at dawn, in the middle of the Pacific War, Operation Hailstorm began. Within two days, more than 60 Japanese warships were sunk. On board one of these ships was a legendary object. A sacred mirror that a sailor had stolen from a kafun to protect him from bad luck. In the 4th century, this same mirror repeatedly saved the life of the Emperor Ishuta, who fought against cruel and barbarian hordes that swept through the fertile plains of Yamoto time and time again. Fifty years later, Archaeologist John Brady disappeared in Micronesia while searching for this highly valued mirror. Your name is Chris Young. You have been hired by Steve Grant, head of World Heritage, to set up the underwater observation center Poseidon somewhere in Micronesia. This mission is being led by the famous explorer Jean-Michel Cousteau, who will welcome you on board the Antares. Hello, I'm Steve Grant. As Jean-Michel explained, you join us in our study of the environment. By watching the impact of global environmental trends on the coral reefs, we hope to predict what the impact of such trends will be on the entire planet. Our first job is to find an ideal site among the reefs for a research habitat, the Poseidon. During your mission, you will receive suspicious video recordings of John Brady that are meant to divert you from your path. Steve, take it easy. When you see this video, you being the great friend you are, you let emotion override reason. I imagine you throwing every resource at finding me. It isn't necessary. I'm as well as can be expected. To find the path of John Brady again, you must confront numerous obstacles. You dive deep into the middle of Japanese shipwrecks sunk during World War II. Explore underwater worlds. Plunge into hostile jungles. Find clues, solve riddles, piece together a 50-year-old enigma. But don't expect to get off so easily. There are certain people who would like to put a stop to your research. Is the Antares crew as reliable as you think? Are you with the real Professor Sinus? The beautiful Luciana Capucci? The mysterious An Fong? And are you with Edward, the human computer? What has happened to John Brady? What is this wonderful sight he's discovered? What do the mysterious drawings on the houses of Babeldaob mean? What in the world could the strange message sent by the Betty Bomber mean? What will you discover in the Japanese headquarters? What secrets are hidden in Jellyfish Lake? Who is Malikeok? Where is the sacred mirror of Kofun hidden? To answer all of these plaguing questions, you possess high-power instruments like an autopilot, allowing you to steer the Antares with ease. An interphone, including an automatic translation function. The Angel Sharks and their original digital and integrated image system. Edward provides you with permanent help with suggestions and commentaries. Consult a multimedia encyclopedia of 17 entries rich in scientific and technical information illustrated with photos, videos and animations. The World Network provides access to databases worldwide. Scanning and analytic instruments allow you to decipher the documents you discover. Future Concept, Jean-Michel Cousteau Production and M Interactive take you into the depths of adventure in the quest for the sacred mirror of Kofun. The Sacred Mirror of Kofun is a story made mostly of references to historic events dating from antiquity and World War II. It also includes accurate scientific, geographic and biological material which makes it one of the first games to benefit from cultural content. Original mysteries are also written into the story. The Sacred Mirror of Kofun, the first adventure game that contains underwater images on three CD-ROMs. 50 hours of games, 2 hours of video, 500 photos, 250 3D images and animations, 10 VR locations and 8 actors.